meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. And we are checking out some rainfall this evening. Have that umbrella with you. 53 at 7 o'clock, 55 at 9 p.m., 57 at 11. Yeah, the temperatures are going up. We have warmer air coming in from the south, so readings will hold steady or slowly rise as we go through the night. 61 at 8 o'clock, 64 degrees at noon, and 66 at 5 o'clock. Better chances of steadier rain tomorrow morning. Then some scattered showers in the afternoon, perhaps a rumble or two of thunder. So the rain spreading south to north across the region tonight. Heaviest is going to be tonight. And then we'll have that breezy, unsettled weather around for tomorrow. And the total rainfall, most areas will be picking up about one to two inches here up through a Wednesday late evening and into Thursday early morning. But there could be a few sp uh, spots here and there that pick up even a little bit more rain than that as all that precipitation comes down. Our stall vision camera tonight, a wet evening commute out there on Indian Ripple Road and 675 in Beaver Creek. And it's going to stay that way through this evening with the rain coming down up to seven hundredths of an inch now for the day. 50 degrees are high today, 46, our low temperature this morning. And right now, as we look at the current conditions here in Dayton, we're at 50 degrees, 50 in Springfield, 51 in Springboro, and 51 at Wright Pat, all those areas reporting rain, and our weather checkers reporting rain too. Tom Wyckoff up in Springfield, the coolest reading of the bunch at 48 degrees, but heading southward to Hope Kolke and Bellbrook at 52, so you can kind of get an idea of the temperature spread there. Looking farther south, 55 at Lexington, 57 at Louisville, so this is the milder air that will continue to work northward as we go through the evening and overnight hours. Rain falling right now in downtown Dayton as we check out live Doppler 2 HD and more rain coming up from the south and west. As a matter of fact, some of the pockets of heavier rain south of Indianapolis through the Louisville area and this is all spreading northeastward. So we're going to be dealing with quite a bit of rain tonight. It has been quite dry, so really we're not expecting any significant flooding problems. Our future track rainfall forecast here uh, showing a lot of areas anywhere from uh, Louisville, southern Indiana, northern Kentucky, uh, right on up toward the Port Clinton area in Toledo could see in the range of one to two inches here as we go through the next 24 to 36 hours. Maybe a couple of uh, showers, lighter showers this evening at 6 o'clock. Then we get on that heavier rain. That'll still be impacting areas for the morning commute tomorrow. Then more in the way of scattered showers tomorrow afternoon at 1 o'clock, maybe a, a rumble of thunder as well, and that chance will continue into the evening hours. And then the final sweep of moisture will be coming in as we co go past uh, midnight, and we should be getting back to dry conditions there into the early morning hours. Our forecast tonight, periods of rain could be heavy at times, temperatures slowly rising through the 50s, east-southeast winds at 10 to 20, and then some rain around tomorrow morning, chance for a thunderstorm in the afternoon, those south-southwest winds at 15 to 25. So a slow rise in readings tomorrow, but a mild day up into the 60s, down to 65 at 6 o'clock with a chance of showers. And then your Storm Team 2 7 day forecast. Windy, cooler conditions on Thursday, a high of 53 degrees, 56 on Friday with quite a bit of sunshine. Looks like late Saturday, at least a slight chance of seeing some rain there. And our evening outlook, as you can see, uh, temperatures expected uh, to be into the 50s as we go through the evening hours here with those east winds at about 10 to 20 miles per hour. So uh, definitely it is going to be wet. So uh, just take it easy out there on those roads. Yeah. Watch out for those wet leaves too. Yeah, yeah. That's a good point. They can be like